And so at this time, I would ask the presence of their excellencies roaring wastes, Baron Louis and Baroness Sav. I need my mandolin, Diane. Now you got a path for tick yet. Shh. I don't know. You haven't tuned it in a while. Okay. Meow. Okay. <laughs> 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 Majesty sighs, said instead, could we please make this the war of joie de vivre? <laughs> the great plague is past, but shadows still cloak the mid-realm in gloom. Our people need hope. We must give them my love, the most joyful of wars. Hard work and fun beget esprit de corps. Leroy Louis said yes, dear, agreed. The East King and I shall eschew enmity. We'll balance the sides to make battles fair. But tigers can't count, so say la guerre. <laughs> the war barge shall sing in the bright early morn. We'll party all night from dusk until dawn. No matter foul weather, why worry if we get soggy or soused? So say la vie. <laughs> the highbrows were miffed. Their opinion was strong. Your majesties, please, you're having fun wrong. <laughs> Dragon will waken. His anger will flare. But the king and the queen said, no, no, au contraire. <laughs> we who were there at Penzik 50 with Louis and Sive made grand memories. I may be a fool, but this I believe. All wars should be wars of joie de vivre. All wars should be wars of joie de vivre. All wars should be wars of joie de vivre. Louis and Sive! <laughs> 